And so that's, this is Matthew 52, from Matthew 51, like that. Um, it's about there. It's a tenth, if that is 864 over 7 miles. This is 86.4 over 7 miles. So that, right. it's all the same. But then here is Matthew Avery, which is actually a quarter degree mm -hmm. from this. And it's 4 7, that's sort of. Uh, Four sevenths up the uh, up between from the equations of the pole. It's one well, seventh. It, it's 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 one seventh of the circle around the Earth. Right. From the equation of the pole. Right. It. So, it's right. so it's fifty one point. It's three sixty over seven. Less you three sixty over seven degrees. Right. Exactly. Right. Right. Point 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 right. right. Yeah. And there's an obelisk that marks it. Right. Well, I think it's north of that actually. Yeah, but it's it's within a few feet, isn't it? Well, a few yards. Yeah. But I think this is the northern part of it. But you have to think it's But anyway. Um, and then the, the distance from Avery to Matthew 52 is 39.497142 miles, which is the hundredth part of the per is 3949.7142. The, the, the miles, the radius right. of the earth, mm. and then another line to it gives you the the, 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 the the mean value of the earth's uh, uh, radius, and the one through Silver Hill it gives you the equatorial radius. And they're all uh, exact. Spread out very clear and figures. All exact. It, yeah, it also shows you how the line of the state, how it then uh, 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 the, the line from glass is an angle to it. But right angles the one to Avery. Then there's a 144 degree turn to, to Goring. It's part of the circle of perpetual fires, you call it. And that fits in. And you can work out the actual sunrise angle because it's the angle from Glossary to Stonehenge, which is right angle that one, plus uh, 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 three, I think it's 3.84 degrees, mm. which you can calculate from taking off as being, as being that little angle. Which makes this one uh, virtually 50 degrees. You get what? And they're very near within a minute or two of what Tom actually but Tom said it's about 50 degrees. Yes, 49.57 minutes. Or yeah, something. because to almost precisely that. Yes. Calculated. That's the, the axis of stone. Uh, right. And then, so I do this, but, but not as meridians, but as actual parallel lines. Right. Uh, this goes up to Holy Island. Right. But it's. It's, it's not a measurement. These are measures. This is, if you take it in in ratios, this is 600 miles. Right. So that it is, you divide it into 20, that's 3, that's 7, and that's 11. Right. And moreover, in miles, you get, no, not measures, but ratios. You know, the ratio for, for pi, which you use is 23 over 7. This is 2200 over 7 miles. Right. 100 times 23 over 7. Right. That's exactly 200 <coughs> miles, and that's 600 over 7 miles, and it is 3, 7, 11. And if you add that to that, then it's 3, 6, over, over 7 miles, and the main unit is 36 over 7 miles. Right. It gives it, 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 both metrological, astronomical, and musical right. information. Uh, and this is just the, the, the better outline of it. It comes down to the lowest latitude <coughs> of the British Isles. From St Mary's City, right. just below the tip of Bolt Head, that's at Salkham, isn't oh, it? Bolt, not just Bolt Head, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, that's right. Yes, uh, and that's the state of well, the other <coughs> subdivisions of it. That's the Cross of Man, you see. Mm -hmm. um, this is uh, exactly two hundred. Cumbria and places like that. Yeah, well, it goes, it goes to Barrow in Furness. Right. Mm -hmm. okay. Thank <laughs> you.